ஹலோ ஐம் டாக்டர் கொட்லாடி சுரேந்திர ஷெட்டி ஸ்பைன் சர்ஜன் ஃப்ரம் ஸ்பைன் கேர் அண்ட் ஆர்த்தோ கேர் ஹாஸ்பிட்டல் டோல்கேட் மாக்டி ரோட் ராஜாஜி நகர் Sometimes the lumbar spine, the degeneration may be if, I mean, associated with scoliosis. We call it as a degenerative scoliosis. In this case, what happens is multiple discs are involved. So many discs are involved. They collapse. Sometimes they collapse uniformly. Sometimes they collapse to one side. So for example, only the right side of the disc, I mean, all may be collapsed and it is turned to the uh, whole of the spine is turned to one side you get a degenerative scoliosis in such cases they usually have a lot of back pain associated with movement so they cannot sit for a long time what we call is a sitting intolerance they cannot stand in one place for a long time or they can they will find the pain even while rolling in the bed so and they may have a radiating pain all along the lower limb in the buttocks in the uh, ca- I mean the back of the thigh and back of the calf muscles or sometimes in the foot they may also have some weakness in the foot like they may find difficulty in uh, I mean putting the uh, foot up or down or the toes up and down so in such cases we have to treat them we have to take standing mri or a standing uh, x-rays bending forward x-rays bending backward x-rays sometimes standing front views x-rays and find out how much stable is the spine once we find the stability of this thing and what segment of this thing the scoliosis extending from which level to which level then we have to plan the surgery sometimes we need multi level fusion surgeries sometimes extending from L1 to S1 or sometimes up up also so we have to treat these patients usually with surgeries